now to something more soothing. Preserving <laughs> Europe's rich collection of art for future generations is a painstaking process. The restoration is hugely time-consuming when it's done properly, but Spain is developing something of a reputation. Oh, yes. The latest aberration comes in Palencia, north of Madrid, on a statue originally unveiled in 1923, which, as you can see, needed some work. This is how it turned out. The statue that social media has dubbed the potato head of Palencia. Let me just put it side by side for you. Yeah. It's not even close, is it? Anyway, this is just one of a litany of botched jobs in Spain. An invaluable opportunity, then, to show you them again. Yes, here are some 15th century sculptures. The one on the left, Jesus's robe, has been painted in some radioactive green hue, while Mary is in a pink cloak. Then there's the work on the 16th century statue of St George and the Dragon. In that left one, look, poor old George looking like Fireman Sam. <laughs> And then there's this on the face of the Virgin Mary in Valencia. But best of all, it's still my favourite. It has to be, doesn't it? The 2012 restoration of a fresco in the town of Borja, known as Monkey Christ, lovingly restored uh, by the elderly parishioner at her church. Can we put up the potato head of Palencia just one more time? Because I want to know what... I the actually think, you know, Christian, it's Picasso-esque. If we look at it, you'll <laughs> see that the restoration is definitely Picasso. That's what's speaking to me there. I, I don't I think want you to know what, it's a botched what, restoration at all. I want to know what the restorer thought when they climbed down the ladder and they stood back and they looked at their work and they thought, yeah, smiling maiden. Have I got it just right? I think so. That is definitely some of my best work. <laughs> I would say for sure. And then they toasted their excellent work, Christian. Yeah. The uh, restorers, the professional restorers said, hashtag, this is not a restoration.